Welcome back to Minds and Money. London coming up. And with us today in prep for this absolutely amazing show we're going to have in London, we have Grant Moore, CEO of SPC Nickel, a fairly new listing out of Sudbury, Ontario. Welcome, Grant. Thank you. Thanks for having us. Tell us a little bit about the what's going on in Sudbury, Ontario, what you guys are up to at SPC Nickel. Okay, well, uh, SPC Nickel is a relatively new uh, new junior exploration company focused on the TSXV. Uh, we listed it about a year ago, uh, and our focus is primarily on nickel and the commodities related to nickel, so things like copper, platinum, palladium. Uh, we have four fly, uh, projects across Canada, but our flagship operation is really within the Sudbury Mining District. And for people that don't know, uh, Sudbury is arguably one of the, the biggest uh, uh, and top nickel producers in the world. And nickel is a very, very hot commodity right now, is it not? Yes, it is. Uh, so tell, it, tell us a little bit more about this flagship project. That I believe it's uh, Locker B East. Yeah. So it's a... Uh, it's a former past producer. Uh, it was originally mined by Falconbridge Limited. We acquired the property in 2016. It has uh, two historic resources on it. There is a shallow, large, low-grade resource of around 10 million tons at about a half percent copper, or sorry, half percent nickel and about 0.3 percent copper, and that comes to surface. And then there is a smaller high grade deposit at depth that was actually historically mined in the 80s and 90s by Falconbridge of a few hundred thousand tons, but it is much higher grade in the two and a half percent nickel range. And we feel that deposit is open at depth. And, you know, that'll be the focus of our exploration activities for this year. We'll be advancing the Lockerbie, the West Graham resource, it's called, which is a larger, lower grade resource, as well uh, evaluating the, the down dip potential of the high grade mineralization that's there oh, that's pretty exciting and and tell us a, a little bit about the team that's rolling this out yeah i mean we're all uh most almost the entire team is long-term sudbury people nickel people so uh you know most of the team is made up with people uh who have formerly worked with either inco valet falconbridge uh extrata glencore so you know spent most of their career in sudbury uh, have been successful making discoveries in Sudbury. So we've got a really well-rounded team that knows the areas that we're working in, knows the commodity that we're working in, and uh, knows how to make discoveries and and build build new mines. And that's really kind of what we've put together is a, is a pretty strong board and management for a smaller junior company. That's great, Grant. And being a new, uh, a fairly new symbol on the on the exchange is the is the idea to get to production or are you just proving the uh, resource? Well, I think when we started the company, the goal was to try to become a producer in Sudbury. Uh, obviously we're open to, when we get to that stage, uh, you know, we're open to all sorts of different opportunities, whether that might be a merger or, you know, if someone is interested in the resource that we have. Uh, but you know, we're moving forward with the, with the notion that we're going to try to bring this Lockerbie East project into production. And that's kind of our goal. If along the way, some, a different uh, opportunity presents itself, I mean, we, we have to evaluate those opportunities. Great, great, great. Well, let's, uh, let's segue a little bit with that runway that we're talking about. What does that look like for you guys in terms of cash flow? And how do you see yourselves uh, playing out the rest of 2022? What are some of the catalysts that investors should know about? Yeah, we're cash flow wise, we're in good shape. We financed just at the beginning of this year. So we have about five and a half million dollars in the bank. Um, so our pro projects for this year are fully funded. We'll be uh, getting the drills turning here in the next week or so. And those will be running throughout the spring, summer and fall. So the, most of the big catalysts moving forward for us will be results from our drilling at the Lockerbie East project, as well as two of our other projects in Canada, and ideally moving towards updating our resource towards the end of the year. And that'll allow us to be able to make the decision on what the next steps are for that project. Grant, Sudbury has a proven track record. It sounds like you guys have the right team in the right place at the right time. Yes. Hot, hot, hot market for you. I'm excited to see what happens uh, as the year rolls out. Tell us a little bit about Minds and Money London. I know we're going to see you there. Tell us uh, what your involvement is going to when you get there. 
Yeah, I'm excited to uh, to go to the show. It'll be my first in-person conference in, in over two years. So we're looking forward to it. Uh, I'll be doing a short presentation uh, and we have a booth. So we have some meeting slots open. So if anyone is interested to learn more about SPC Nickel and what we're doing, feel free to uh, to give us a call and we can set up a meeting. Excellent. Well, we're looking forward to connecting there as well. Uh, we'll get out on the town maybe a little bit, enjoy a beer, and uh, enjoy everything that London has to offer. It's Sounds a like different location this year over by the eye, so that should be beautiful as well. Grant Moore of CEO, the CEO of SPC Nickel, thank you very much. Thank you.